Okay, right now we're going to show you how to load material in the Fusion Channel Letter Machine. Alright, so first thing you want to do, put your coil up here. Alright. I'm going to take the coil and we're going to go on the outside of this red roller. That's the only one it goes on the outside of. I'm going to stick it in the straightener. So now, here you have your V-groove that's seated in the machine. And you have three, three places for this to be. This high place right here, that's for reverse channel letters, or letters with no flange. That place is for half inch flange. And this is for a quarter inch flange. So we're gonna do half inch flange, standard channel letters. All right, so get that out of your way. Now, I'm going to slide the material in and I'm going to make sure that the machine's off. If it's not off, hit your emergency stop on the monitor there. That'll shut it down. So now I'm going to just put it in the material here. I'm going to put the material in the V-groove down at the bottom and I'm going to set this side. Right? And now I'm going to work it through the drive box this hand wheel. So now we're going to go to the other side of the drive box and all right so see the material coming through you may have to use a screwdriver or something to get it started in the v-groove roller. Now the most common problem that we've seen is people get this material on this side of the roller. Well, I can't quite get it here. They do that that's a problem. You don't want to do that. You want to make sure it's right in the middle. Now, get this out of the way. Now that it's in the middle, now here's the trick. I'm going to lift up on this part of the coil with one hand, and I'm going to rock the material back and forth. And what that's doing, it's rocking it back and forth, and it's seating this part of the material in that V-groove. I can try to reach in with my finger and spin the wheel, and I can feel that there's contact. I can't spin that wheel. So I know I'm, I'm down in the right position. I'm going to go back to this side and I'm going to hold down and I'm going to rock it and make sure I'm seated and double check. See, this side needs to come down just a little bit. Just a little bit. Okay. And that's it. It doesn't matter where it's at as long as it's inside the machine.